Hello everyone, how to simplify this nice algebraic expression if we have 9 divided by 4 and its whole exponent is also 9 divided by 4. So we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form but here you remember one thing is that calculator is not allowed in this problem this means that we need to show all of the working on this paper okay so that's why we solve this problem step by step and here I can just give you all the details of this question. I hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section and now we move towards the solution of this problem uh, so here first we need to focus on the base of this term and its base is 9 divided by 4 so we write this base into the prime factors form we know about that the prime factors of 9 are 3 square and the prime factors of 4 are 2 square and its whole exponent is 9 divided by 4 okay so here uh, we need to use the nice exponential law you know about that if we have a to the power of m divided by b to the power of m is equals to a divided by b and its whole power is m so according to this rule of exponents uh, we need to combine the exponent of these two terms and after combine the exponent it will be written as 3 over 2 whole square and its whole power is 9 divided by 4 and now here further in the next step we use another exponential law you know about that if we have a to the power of m to the power of n is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n so according to this rule of exponents we need to multiply these two exponents okay so here we multiply 2 times 9 divided by 4 after applying this rule it will be written as 3 divided by 2 and its whole power is 2 multiplied by 9 divided by 4 so here we need more simplifications and it will be written as this is 3 divided by 2 and its whole power is this is 2 times 2 becomes 4 and we obtain this is 9 divided by 2. So further uh, in the next step here we need more simplifications uh, and it will be written as here first we need to focus on a nominator term this is 9 and now we break this 9 as uh, 8 plus 1 so we have this is 8 plus 1 divided by 2 and now here in the next step we need to break this fraction and when we break this fraction it will be written as 3 divided by 2 and its whole exponent is 8 divided by 2 plus 1 divided by 2 and we have this is 2 times 4 becomes 8 and further we have this is 3 divided by 2 to the power of 4 plus 1 divided by 2 and here in the next step we use another exponential law you know that if we have a to the power of m plus n is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n so according to this rule uh, here we just uh, break this uh, uh, sum and we write these terms as in this form this is 3 divided by 2 to the power of 4 is multiplied by 3 divided by 2 and its whole power is 1 over 2 okay so according to this rule we write this step and further here uh, in the next step we again use another law so you know that if we have a divided by b and its whole power is m so this is equals to a to the power of m divided by b to the power of m so according to this rule here we apply this exponent separately on both of these two terms as well as this exponent 1 over 2 separately on both of these two terms so here after applying uh, this exponential law this will be written as 3 to the power of 4 divided by 2 to the power of 4 is multiplied by this is 3 to the power of 1 over 2 divided by 2 to the power of 1 over 2 <clears throat> so further in the next step here uh, we need more simplification and it will be written as uh, so uh, here uh, we need to focus all of these terms as of one by one so we have this is uh, so this is 3 to the power of 4 and you very well know about that the meaning of 3 to the power of 4 is that we multiply 3 with 4 times okay 
in this way so you know that 3 times 3 becomes 9 9 times 3 becomes 27 27 times of 3 becomes here 81 it means that 3 to the power of 4 is equals to 81 and in the same pattern we have this is 2 to the power of 4 means that we multiply 2 with 4 times so we have this is 2 times 2 becomes 4 and this is 4 times uh, 4 times of 2 becomes 8 8 times of 2 becomes here 16 so this is 2 to the power of 4 is equals to 16 and now uh, further we have this is 3 to the power of 1 over 2 and the meaning of 3 to the power of 1 over 2 is that we write this uh, exponential term mm, into the radical form so this will become uh, square root of 3 and in the same pattern we write 2 to the power of 1 over 2 as square root of 2 so here we need to substitute all of these values uh, in this expression okay so uh, after substituting all of these values to the above expression it will be written as 81 divided by 16 into square root of 3 divided by square root of 2 so here we need to rationalize this term for write our answer into the simplified form so for uh, here we can just multiply and divide this term by square root of 2 so here you see that the square root of both of we need to combine the square root of these two terms and it will be written as 81 times of uh, 3 multiplied by 2 and we have this is 16 times of this will become square root of 2 and its whole square so this 2 and this square root are gone and finally we will get here 81 times of square root of 6 divided by this is here we get 2 and 16 times 2 becomes 32 so this is our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos